you have a plan C. All right, welcome everybody to the Courtesy Flush. Joining me this evening is a friend of the uh, of me and and people I know, and a person that exists for real. His name is Squick. Yes, hello. I'm here from the internet, and I'm very, very real. I'm also Probably. over here uh, on the stream. This is the so we're going to be playing Space Quest 1987 uh, with the parser text typing and everything. This is the MT32 which I've had for a while now. We're going to use this as the uh, audio device for the stream. So we're going to get a, a little bit more of an authentic... Uh, a, I don't know if it's authentic. I mean, authentic would probably be PC speaker. It's authentic now. PC speaker, probably. <laughs> it's probably <laughs> he's squick. He comes from the net, indeed. I'm doing all right. But yeah, uh, we're going to play some of that. Um, now, I've only played a little bit of Space Quest in my time. I played, uh, I think, Space Quest 6 a little bit, and then Space Quest 1, just a very few bits. I've never beaten a single one of these games because they were just, they weren't something I bought when I was a kid. Like, my grandmother never got them. So I only played, like, a few minutes of, uh, I think, a shareware or something of one of them. And Squick's never played any of them either, so this is going to be interesting. To be fair, I played a whole 20 seconds the MSI Dragon. It makes mouth noise. It is the MSI Dragon. Actually, here's the other MSI Dragon. Let's see. I'll focus. Yeah, it's right here. Got that guy. Actually, this is my little USB head. It's cursed. Because when you open it, it <laughs> turns into a USB stick. Yeah. All Many right. things turn into a USB stick. That's how you the get... bus truly is universal. Indeed. The USB 2.0, I believe. At any rate, Ooh. let's uh let's go into Space Quest. Let's Space load this up. Quest. Wait, that's King's Quest. Which Scum VM? Ah, yes. I am learning with my hands. And then let's go ahead and just hit start. It already has it selected. It it again. Mouse. Mouse come there. Yes. I've mastered clicking. And then we got the chill vibes. By two guys from Andromeda. By two guys from Andromeda. Mark Crow and Scott Murphy. Hell yeah. Wait, no, that's more than two guys. Now well, it's Jeff Stevenson <laughs> and Chris somebody and Scott Murphy and... Yes, yeah, Sol Ackerman. Ackerman. <laughs> yeah, Mark Ken Crow Williams. again. He's no, back. You can't do two things, Mark Crow. Light years from Earth's solar system, the people of the galaxy Irnon have been struggling to maintain the precious balance of life. The son of Irnon is slowly dying. 
The planets grow cold. Food is no longer plentiful. Life will soon become impossible to sustain. The scientific community of Xenon devised a plan to convert one of Irnon's lifeless planets into a new sun. That is definitely how that works and will have no other consequences. The effort was centered around the development of a device called the Star Generator. The Star Generator would be capable of igniting an otherwise lifeless planet into a raging ball of flame. An expedition set out aboard the starship Akata to successfully complete the development and testing of the Star Generator. The Akata is now returning yes. triumphantly to Xenon with the fully operational Star Generator. I, I have a feeling that they they probably pronounced it Arcada because they're <laughs> they're nerds like me. <laughs> you mean Arcada? Yeah. I, I want like I want that on sandwich space bread. Oh yeah, there uh, we go. Anyway, we're like a shit janitor and they can't fire us because we're in space. So good luck at it. I probably have been sacked or replaced where the Arcada were not millions of kilometers from Xenon. I that's fair, but what if you just like secretly snuck on board with a Roomba and you just leave them bumping around well, we're... on the ship the whole time. As we join our story, you have just completed one of your famous on-shift naps in one of the janitorial storage closets. I appreciate how it's both famous and in the janitorial storage closet. You're, it's a famous nap. Man, that's, that's a powerful nap here in space. Music end. Welcome. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yes. Eight. Music complete. 18 characters. You are um, okay, so what the hell do we call Janitor Spaceman? Yeah, what do you guys want to call Janitor Spaceman? This is why Crobon's people no longer have a home. <laughs> oh, cool. You guys gave the MS Dragon, <laughs> MS Dragon an almost realistic AI voice. Good job, Mike. Thanks. Yeah, I mean, he's very talented. I worked really hard on that MSI Space Dragon. Actually, I didn't. I just clicked on it and put a mustache and a hat on it. Look, I don't have much. Look, you got, I'm not a designer. I can't do it, all right? I did what I could. Spe Spec Bob. Janitor Captain. Janitor Captain. I cannot do that voice. I appreciate that voice. I cannot Janitor do that Captain. voice. Janitor Captain. Yeah. Janitor Captain. That yeah. was very incorrect accent. Spec Bob. Fuzz Mopton. Fuzz Moptron, um, Sweep Moppington, <laughs> Space Greg. Space Greg. Indeed. Let's go, Space Greg. Hell yeah. Space Greg has entered that. Oh, oh, sweet. I have like an alarm clock. This you is, are startled by the sound of an alarm. It is followed by an urgent voice, which is warned that the Arcada has been boarded by an unknown intruders. It ends abruptly. Cool. That sounds like a security problem. How do we get back in there and go for... Uh, well, you just got to click first. Close I'm, the... I'm trying. It, ah, there. There you go. Go back to sleep. I don't understand oh. your request. Ship computer, I wish to engage in nap time. There are problems out here, and I don't need them to be my problems. And just feel free to read whatever text you want. Everything is going wrong immediately. It's very quiet, though. <laughs> I love your little jumpy well, I mean, stop. Look, I I found a corner to hide in. That's good. Um, it's which <laughs> everything looks like 200. everything's going wrong immediately. It, <laughs> on your one of your famous naps? No. Look, man, I'm I'm doing that power nap, power strut. See, they're napping too. Nobody's bitching about that. No, I don't think they're napping unless they ate a lot of ketchup and just got it on them. You know, they they passed out from. You know, the ketchup party. I mean, I've done that. That's Maybe normal. that's what this is. It's a ketchup party. You know, what's funny but, is you haven't really, like, looked at anything. You're just walking around. Wait, you can look at things? You have to use the parser to get your character to do anything. Oh, right. Examine. Legs. I don't understand the legs, but he understands examine, so you at least have that. Okay, cool. So we're making progress. Um. Um. Yes. Seven lamp. Look at sky flashy thing. I don't understand. But it flashy. does understand sky. Okay, we're making pro. Do we need to start like a list of words? Look we at know lights. Understands? I I think you have to go full, further grug when you type stuff because that's what uh, I remember. Right. I remember doing that as a kid where I'm like, look light, grab thing. 
I, lick. I don't understand lick. Well, well, yeah, we're not playing Mean Streets Tex Murphy. We just lick everything. And you can. And you could die in horrible ways for doing so. Uh, okay, then explain this floor. Hey! I've learned words! You did it! What does it say? Hooray! Mm, space Greg happy. Space Greg understand floor. Oh, look. Nope, that's not my problem. <laughs> Where are you going? Come back. <laughs> There's dead people over there. I don't want... Oh, oh maybe they have mind. wallets, though. That's true. A wallet would be useful. Yeah, especially if it's not mine. It'll become mine. I think I hear footsteps. Nope, nope, nope. Oh, that was good. That was close. As you slip away, the alien decides that one of his comrades will take care of you. Ah, uh, they're lazy too, and also I think he was trying to shoot me with a saxophone. <laughs> His careless whisper right in your face. <laughs> but I mean, hey, free wallet over here, maybe. Uh what are you gonna do? Loot, loot, loot that body. body. Loot that body. Loot is not something you know yet. Pilfer body. Pilfer is not a word. <laughs> steal. I don't understand. Oh, you understand steal. <laughs> I get it, but I don't understand why you want to steal. Um. Okay. 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 Acquire body. That's. <laughs> I ha I hope you know how strange that sounds. This, uh, but I, I hope you know. It appears to be one of your crewmates. He's non-functional. Most of my crewmates are non-functional. Why do you think my naps are legendary? They're jealous. Well, that's true. I didn't think of that. <laughs> I just looked at the manual. It says you can generally interact with the game by typing simple commands consisting as little as a noun and a verb. For instance, oh. the command get into the spa escape pod can be shortened to get in pod. Otherwise instructed, follow all commands with enter. EJ will, uh, will understand many common verbs such as look, get, read, load, pry, climb, push, play, tell, card! ask, give, take, and a so on. Oh, you got a key card. And you can repeat a command by hitting F3. That's oddly specific. Indeed. I take the key card. Matter of fact, if you go up to the top bar and click, you can actually get a menu. What? You have to hold it down, though. What? Yeah. And you can save Madness. it. Madness. Well, this is back in the era where, you know, this kind of menu interaction was brand new. Uh, well, not brand new. Everybody just liked because Windows 3.1 was just, like, right around the corner. How far does this go? Uh, very far. I'm sure you could probably keep going to 1,000. Yeah, I think it's about 1,000. <laughs> <laughs> this. Uh... Oh, and we're on the scoreboard. Yeah. Nice. Hey, you said load. Hey, Bolo, how's it going? Hey, howdy. So 1,000. You can have 1,000 yeah. saves. And you can call it. One. Space Greg finds space. Ah. Wallet. The keyboard is killing me. The A key keeps double bouncing. Dear God, the user interface. It's graphical. You found a space wallet space. in space. You found his key card. Yeah. What are you going to do with this key card? Uh, can I use it to go back to sleep? Well, you could go through that door there, or you could look around in your environment and see if there's, like, any... There's another hallway aboard the Arcada, but there is an elevator door nearby. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah, nope, I do, do not get back in there. Do not open the elevator door... See, mm, yeah, sure, is corpsey out there, and then go back home. Okay, now what are you going to do here? You're standing in front of the body. I'm going to look at more bodies. A cursory glance indicates that he is a dead lab technician. Uh, That's not good. Well, I mean, it happens in labs all the time. Okay, it's still... 
You can't attain that here. What were you trying to obtain? I didn't see. I, I was trying to take stuff. No. Oh. Kodak 2411 just followed. Thanks for the courtesy. Welcome. Nice. Sierra's like 1,000 saves. You're going to need it. Yeah. Have you updated your stream toilet? Uh, I added it, so now it just does you have a fax. Yeah, but is that like the same model? Or have you like upgraded the Turbo Fancy Space Toilet? Oh, no, it's the same one that was made for me by uh, Dix, I believe. This is my toilet. It was made for me. Indeed. Search body is what Dwarf Man Zero One says you should try doing. Search body? Okay, okay, I'll try search body. That cannot be done from here. Yes. So you have to get right next to him and then do it. I have used F3 like a gentleman. You search over the body reveals nothing. I don't even get a lab coat? They didn't Lame. really take anything with them, I guess. Nothing. Not even like a dollar for the lunch machine? What about that door? Uh, the alien was down there. Oh. I feel like that should be someone else's problem. You're right. Also, why are the aliens so against us blowing up our own planet? <laughs> yeah, it's true. Wait, that's that's where I came from. Yeah, the next Star Trek is supposed to take place in a space station. I just need to uh, overcome some personal challenges before I run a tabletop game live. Oh. Personal I'm... challenges, TM. <laughs> Wait, what's up with those walls? Why is this wall weird? Well, look at the walls. No. Unable to be tricked, you cleverly deduce that there are indeed walls in here. They are just your run-of-the-mill spacecraft interior walls. Diabolical. You are so abst you are so astute. You can't you can't be fooled by these walls. That doesn't seem to be a correct action in this case. Okay, so it doesn't like opening the wall. Well, there are a couple yet. of hallways. There's one upstairs and another one. See, there's a door there at the end of the hallway on the second floor. You never looked at it. Well, yeah, I thought that was like a theater curtain. I didn't want to be rude. Maybe they're in the That's middle of intermission. That's true. All right, fine. Let's go check out the theater. <laughs> <laughs> I'm the best detective. I've learned that there are walls. I stole somebody's wallet. I didn't lick the wall because the overlord wouldn't let me. That's fair. That's fair. I'm excited for it. I don't understand. <laughs> wow. Well. You have to look at door. Try that. Yeah. Mm. Let's consume wall. You're typing wall. Try the <laughs> try the word door. <laughs> that would lack any serious gratification. But what if? Fine. Or I guess I should. You're too far away to get a good look. Maybe it's about I'm... one downstairs. Open door. I, I guess I just I don't want to let the system win. Well, you're gonna have to in the case of Sierra Games. They want that very specific that's... answer. Okay, so that's not that's not nothing then. Or that's nothing. I don't understand explode, but you will <laughs> very shortly. <laughs> so that's far you fine. have stolen a key card and gained one point. Hell yeah. High score on the board. That's why my naps are legendary. Also, I like that you did bring a, a mechanical keyboard to this, because that does make it seem appropriate. <laughs> well, you don't have much of a choice but to maybe go down the hallway or through a door. Not much left. Yeah, okay, so... I There's not guess... much left of the doorway. Someone has blown it open. That's fine. That happens. I've, I'm the... I've done the same. Oh, yeah, it's more corpsey over here. Cool, let's... Uh... That is just a curtain. That is straight up a space curtain. I also put a death haven't... counter on the stream, so don't feel bad. I think you hear footsteps. Your legs will take you where you want to go, in most cases, anyway. Uh. You need to move. I. But if I move, I die. You have no choice. <laughs> it's... Oh, you died! Oh no, my organ... Oh, he's playing a jazz solo. The alien observes his handiwork briefly, then leaves. Yes, you lie on the floor in a smoldering car... Oh, wait, you read this, because that's a great word for you. As you lie on the floor in a smoldering... 
carbogelatinous heap. Yeah. Can't help but wonder why you bothered getting up this morning. You didn't. You got up this afternoon. You got one point. Oh, thank, thank you. Thank you for, for playing Space Quest. Oh, go ahead. <laughs> no, you go ahead. Thank you for playing Space Quest. Too bad you failed miserably and doomed all your people to a horrible death at the hands of the Sarans. If you continue playing as skillfully as this, you'll never have a chance for a sequel. Better luck next time. That's fair. If we had planned this as a bit, that would be the smash cut to end stream. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> just gets killed, and that's the end of the stream. <laughs> God, that would just be Sierra game any percent speed run. Yeah, now you just uh, reload percentage... the game, because now you can just stare at the screen. <laughs> it's old school games. <laughs> All right, so you found a space uh, wallet. Leaving off from Well, where I you... found a space wally. Ah. <laughs> Carbon jelly or carb based jello? Carbo gelatinous. Dude, get in get all the way in the elevator. So you're just gonna need to go right, it looks like. Yes, I will strut past the dead things because I'm not dead in this reality. If we were playing this game back then, uh the computer would be making so much noise, the room would be a million degrees. And this would be wow. Yeah, we would have PC speakers, so it'd be screeching. <laughs> this, this is another one of your non-functional crewmates. It's a grisly sight. Non-functional human. <laughs> oh, you have to. Uh, God, what was the word? Um, search body. Ah, oh, yeah. Wow. I swear I know how to use human keyboard. No, nothing there. Well, now you have another door, but who, I think that goes down, maybe? Who knows? Um, Guess you'll have to find out by being brave. I, I gonna, So far, I get the get, feeling that most of this game is you going to... You're going to end up solving this crisis, not because you need want to, but because you did it on accident, trying to get away. Look, I'm just trying to find the space... Oh, yeah, this, this was an excellent use of time. Very efficient. <laughs> Look, you work here as a janitor. You should know this place in or out. Uh, no, no, Squirt, no. Where I are you hang going? out here as a janitor. Oh, right. Your famous naps. Forgot. For I provide this... an essential service to the crew. Oh, yes. Death one. Thank you. Adding death to the counter. Oh, yes. Good, 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 good. I... Oh, hey. They've got a wrestling arena. That. You think you hear footsteps? Nope. <laughs> then you run back <laughs> up there. It's. Uh, yeah. What? Nope. Nope, I'm hiding. You have to get out of it and then come back in. This elevator sucks. Yep. Unable to see anyone here. The <laughs> alien leaves to search elsewhere. <laughs> yes. Oh. Oh, that's fantastic. Good Except job. Except there's a dead man. end over where he went, so. Yeah, I'm not going to question that. But hey, you did it. I like the musical doors. <laughs> Those seem very what, important. In... It's a uh, apparently it's a acoustic, acoustic piano. That's what it is. I, I just looked back at the MT thirty two. That's what's that's what's doing the noise. Guess it's time for Moon Logic, the series. Oops, you moved away from the body. What? You can use the there, arrow no, keys actually to move your character. What? You search of the laser riddled corpse reveals nothing. Say what? Steve, if it's laser riddled, then the lasers should still be there, and I should be able to pocket them. Also, can you do me a favor when you type out yeah. your parsing? Can you like say it out loud? Oh yes, absolutely. My so apologies. for for anybody who's listening, um, am I in a giant pinball machine? It looks like the engine room of of the Enterprise, actually, kind of. Yeah. Okay. Uh, in the original body. Enterprise. Here lies another heap of fried humanity. The attackers have proven to be very thorough thus far. There's something to be said for not being the hero type, you rationalize. <laughs> yeah, fair. Okay. Another piece of fried humanity just laying right there. What did you type? Oh, yes, yeah, sorry. Eat body, and it said no. That would lack any serious gratification. Well, look, we can hide the crimes. It's fine. Squick, I believe in you. You can double your personal high <laughs> score eventually, says Mad Dog. Hey, we're working up that ladder. Okay, so... Uh, 
search body. You search the damaged body of your fellow crewmen. You get too close in a glimpse of the injury in the pockets. You find nothing. Yeah. Okay, that tracks. But just hit. Um, type in. I'll, yeah. Just type look and look then floor. Oh, just look. Just look by itself. I, that's for every room that you want to look at. Uh, fuck you. We want to be specific. <laughs> I would I, like that's all the other Sierra games. I just type look, and he just looks around. One of the floors there. Uh, there are three domes covering closed access tubes and one badly damaged body. Ooh. Put body in tube. I don't understand tube. You just said tube. I. Uh, you can't prove that. That's fair. Uh, look wall. Uh, look panel. Like you have to, you have to kind of imagine what you're looking at. Oh, I think that's the exit. That's a window. Look window, because that's no, it, not, not there. Look, look in front of where your character's standing. It looks like a. Yeah. Uh, it looks like a launch bay. Yeah. Let's take a look. Look window. Look window. Looking through the window, you can see down into the vehicle bay. So you want to go hotwire something cool while everyone's dead and can't whine about it? Well, let's take a look at the controls. It's controls. Hey, Dendar. Oh, Drendar, excuse me. On the console by the window are two buttons marked open bay door and close bay door. Now I am Whoa, have... 11 months. That's almost a year of courtesy. Hey, Drendar, thanks a lot for the oh, courtesy. Damn. I'm glad you made it back. Hope you've been doing okay. Who looted the bodies? Probably the aliens that shot them. Uh, Open doors, maybe? No. Maybe open it's just a... Door. Meh. Maybe you don't have to do anything. Yeah, it could be it's just a reference, but what if... Push button. Ooh, push open button. Push open button, yes. Say push open, mm -hmm. maybe? Yeah, <gasps> we did it! We opened the door to the vehicle bay! We've made the whole ship deadlier. Or maybe it has a force field like Star Trek Next Generation. That doesn't seem to be the correct action. Hey, you opened the, ba the bay. That's all that matters, right? Yeah, I'm the best janitor. I'm not going to have to sweep that room at all now. This is how every time you join the space station 13 on a late shift, is like, oh, you think you hear footsteps? Footsteps. Getting... Get I'm, into the elevator. I'm, I'm running. I'm running. No, into the elevator, you dangus. In. In. Alas, it does not open. You have adorned the door with a small circle of nose grease where you, Carl Malden, could have gotten ugly. <laughs> Wait. It, it, I'm trying to Yeah, go I hide. Yeah, there you go. Okay. Da, 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 da. <laughs> we are heroes. Da, 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 da. <laughs> I do like that you have um like the the box art's just him holding up the plunger. Say nobody here. <laughs> yes. I don't understand oh. nobody. <laughs> but it does say. Or it does understand say um Actually, there's a key card reader on the side of the door there, or something. Yes, but there are, are footsteps, and as soon as I step out, they're going to be like, Ha-ha, you have flesh meat. We will dine upon your ribs. And I will be like, No, it is not yet the hour of the matinee performance of my ribs. And they'll be like, But we have season tickets and a de I have three points! You do. I just looked up. You have this three points. I think it's mainly because you pressed the button. Oh, I did push a button. Maybe, uh, well, yeah, if he's going to come, he should have came a while ago. Go ahead and try to use the key card on the door. Or use key card. Look panel, maybe? Yeah, look read. Uh, yeah, a lot of this game is going to be us yeah, trying to figure out what we're supposed to. Look wall? The walls hey. are nondescript except for a key card unit near the elevator. It controls access to the level below. Excellent. Well done. Use key card on reader. Yeah, reader is not a word that this game understands. Use key card. You slide the key card into the slot. You hear an audible click. You take back the key card. But when I try and do that to the corpses, I'm the weird one. You didn't even get a chance to search. The oh, yeah, you did, didn't you? You searched this corpse, right? Yeah, I think so. Hey, I understand doors now. Oh, whoa. Uh -huh. Welcome Warning. to... 
Bay. Bay door. By or doors. Yes, doors Dave days are, are open. Look at the spacing. I uh, I wonder who could have done that. Anyway, let's go take a look at this control panel. Certainly. I want to check out this floor. They got like this sweet plush space carpet. There's nothing there that you can't already see. I uh, that's either blood or meat or plush space carpet. It's a and they're very really red carpet. Down. That would make your eyes bleed on a CRT. Yeah, but it would be amazing for walking. Is down hide a command after, like, or a play dead? I don't think so. Play dead would be a good one, wouldn't it? You probably could play dead. I didn't even think of that. Play dead. That does not compute. Uh. Look, panel. The console is adorned with many status indicators. One button on the right is marked airlock. If I push that button, we're all going to die because I left the space window open. No, you won't. There's a force field on it. Which airlock? Look, you got points for that. That seems fine. Oh, yeah. That was the so only... points. Yeah, that's, that's, that's all you did. Okay. Hey, Space Quest. Hey, John, how's it going? Howdy, howdy. Nice high ceiling. I mean, ceilings. I know what's going on, but uh, so far I woke up from a nap, I stole somebody else's identity, and I was only shot by a man with a saxophone once. I guess it was more like a jazz clarinet. Yeah. What's this? The walls look pretty much the same as the others. There's a sign on the back wall. Beneath it is a button on uh, and a left button. Uh, is a right button and a left button. Hmm. Interesting. A right button and a left button. Or you could just go through the door he just opened. I mean, I guess that would give us more information, but what if instead of either of those, I went to save, save or like F a coward? Or F5, the quick save button. Yeah, the, they made the save uh, interface part of Scum VM, which is nice. Finish going into the door. See, I told oh, you. They... And yeah, look, it's okay. from Star Wars. Look, you got the it's little... It's 100%. Oops, uh, I forgot oh, my suit. No. That concludes your experiment in balding effects on total vacuum on the human body, Space Greg. There has <laughs> been an incident. <laughs> space Greg. Deaths, too. All right. Thank yeah. you for playing Space Quest. Too bad you failed miserably and doomed all your... We've read this before. Go away, giant pop-up sign. I'll fight you. I... Dar, dar, dar. Oh, maybe the doors open up a, a, a space suit. So you could go out the door. Could be. All right, press left button to see what opens. Ooh. Push left button. Is that a sock? What's that? Look door. No. Yeah, look floor? No, look door. Try try that. Door. Look left door. Uh, pick up item. Look, just type the word. Now you need to be specific. Dang. Try pushing like, the. What? Yeah. What? Hold on. Hmm. Let me. Let me. Uh. Let me see if there was a verb that we can use. Okay. While well, you do that, I'm gonna push the right button. Oh. Hey, a spacesuit. Probably or like a dude. Look suit. This is a standard issue flight suit designed to protect the wearer from the unique conditions of space travel, such as explosion. Uh, wear suit? I don't have. I'll oh, take suit, uh, maybe. Take suit? Oh, and he puts it on. Look at that. Oh, man, look at me. I'm fancy now. I can nap three times as hard as this. I got to score seven now. Um. So what are these? Are these boots? Uh, I game game work with me here. What the hell are you trying to convey? Other than I'm RoboCop. You're RoboCop. Look at me. I'm doing the RoboCop shuffle. It's Robert Cop. Yes. Space Greg is Number Robert up. Cop in. Space. But will it protect you from space, my lord? I don't know. Let's go find out. 
into the Malort chamber. Oh, uh, maybe this is where you bring your escape vessel here. <laughs> Look, panel. Uh, <laughs> Looking at the console, you see a button marked platform. There are also some gauges which don't interest you. <laughs> press platform. I will press platform. Press platform. Oh, there's now an escape pod here. Cool. Uh, I'm thinking we should use that to leave. Is that uh, that good with everybody? Is this ship is kind of crap, and they took away my napping privileges, and a bunch uh. of people died. <laughs> I don't have enough sandwiches, and that ship is way smaller than I thought it was. You're doing like, good wow. so far. Well, this is one of Arcada's escape pods. You vaguely remember receiving some orientation on these when you joined the crew. Yeah, it was probably under the heading don't. And also, if we catch you inside of here, we are going to do something threatening. Yeah. I mean, I guess it's fine. Um, ride ship. Oh, here we go. All right, remember your training. Oh, I thought I was going to get to use it like a pony. Um, space go. Say what? <laughs> it's like space activate. Enhance escape. I don't understand <laughs> the word enhance. Um, go moon. Go moon. Space, no. <laughs> <laughs> Up, go. Um, launch pod. I don't understand your request. Maybe activate pod. Uh, hit type in like look panel. Maybe there's like a. a but no, I had training on this. I vaguely remember it. Okay. Um. Does this have um, the sound support? That's only Space Quest Two. Yeah, this is um. This is the first nap. one, uh, 1987. Like, what about second nap? You already, yeah, your world famous naps? Yeah. I you already had one. Uh, I think there's a lever there. I'm going to pull it. Pull lever. Le oh, lever. Mm. Uh, yeah, there's no A in it. Uh, there is if I spell it like that. That's true. Please buckle your seatbelt for. Oh. oh, my God. Buckle your seatbelt. Buckle seatbelt like a coward. I don't understand. <laughs> <laughs> Main screen <Fine>. turn on. <laughs> <laughs> Done. Okay, was that really necessary? You have to set your ta tray table in the upright position. Now try it. Nap. You already had your nap. No, but I'm I'm buckled in. It's fine. Now I'm running this on. This is a uh, sound I have uh, hooked up to the MT32. There's just no music for the game. There's, I guess, there's music in the opening, but we haven't heard any thus far. But the MT32 is on. It's working. It's just there's no sounds right here. Okay, now I'm pulling the lever. The door is ajar. The door is ajar. A <laughs> door. Close space door. Like a nerd who understand. Oh, it says I don't need that many letters. Mm. Fine. Close door. Done. The cool. Pull lever. That has no effect now. <laughs> what do you want from me? <laughs> we're just we're go. trying to look. You, look, you have to understand. You're a janitor. This makes sense. Push button. I understand push button. You should specify push which push button, button you would like to push. Why don't you look at the panel and see if there's like... No! Oh. Never! <laughs> that is the coward's choice. <laughs> <laughs> we will discover this. Um, That's the only way to figure out how to solve these games is to look at it. Push on everything. button. Uh, uh, which, um, is there a power button? Push power. Oh my god! Yes! yes! Glorious victory! I am the janitorial king! Um, And then we leave, I guess? Uh, we definitely Activate? should Go. read some of that. However, 
that sounds like not napping, and there's a lever. Yes. And I the escape pod moves slowly out of the vehicle bay and into space. Hell yeah. Dun, oh, dun. we've escaped the Congratulations, you nearly escaped an explosive death. Don't start patting yourself on the back just yet, though. You are now traveling aimlessly through the cosmos. Hell yeah. Joke's on them. I was doing that before. Aimlessly. You think I was driving the ship? Yes. But I'm up to 23 points. That's true. All right. Where to? Um, go Burger Place. Is that not? Is it not like that? It doesn't understand burger. Oh, that's that's so sad. You need to like have a navigation console or something. You're right. Navigate Burger. Navigate Burger. Yeah, don't understand navigate. Okay, that's it. Understands that's... burger, but not navigate. Okay. Okay. This is this um, is pot racing. Look screen. Escape pod activated. Oh, All systems go. <laughs> That's okay. Dude, when you're reading the screen, I need you to not shove your face all the way into the monitor. <laughs> oh, look, there we go. Oh. oh, that's all it took. Due to a lack of navigation, you have exhausted the <laughs> meager amount of emergency fuel, and without finding a safe place to land, you are lost in space. Hell yeah. Wait, that's bad. Is it Holy bad? Snake. Ship does not know glory of burger. Ship is faulty. Um. Uh. Yeah, I think it's mad that I don't have space GPS. Uh, well, and now you died really again. Preferred <laughs> if I three deaths things. so far. Well, that one wasn't dead. It's just alivened. You're right. Oh, <laughs> Sierra. Okay, fine, fine, fine. We're going back in time to another place where we were here. Oh, we didn't. Yeah, we got to push button right. Nope. <laughs> push right button left push button. Uh, that does not compute. Your face doesn't compute. Type the word search. Search. How about nope. examine? Examine. No. Nope. Examine area? Eyeball room. Try Yeah, try... Uh... Examine area. This is the hey! flight prep room end of, uh, of the Arcadia. You can see there is a sign on the back wall as well as two doors and two buttons. Okay. Okay, that that's pretty good. Take suit. Can you uh, open uh, push left? Sure. Push left. Can you say look item? No. Look object? Look object. Are you sure you want to look at that? What? What do you mean? Uh, look left closet. There's some sort of electrical gadget of some sort. Oh. Uh, Take gadget, maybe? Examine gadget? Otherwise, it's just going to be like floor taser. On the floor is some sort of uh, gadget. It looks electronic. Ah, an electronic device. Oh. Oh, this is this game. We may have stumbled into the one piece of lore I know. What? The only thing I might remember about Space Quest, and it could be a very different game, is that in the original... Oh, I don't think it was Space Quest, but there was one of these where it's like, if you don't take the weird machine you have no reason to take or understand with you in, like, the first ten minutes of the game, then four hours later you will be boned in the Space Casino. But I don't think it was this. It was something... Maybe the remake of this? Not sure. Hmm. It could anyway. be. Yeah, we didn't. We we opted out of the remake. Pull. Uh, there's this definitely an. Uh, the Emperor's New Groove has ruined me. <laughs> it's ruined us all. Oh, I think it was just a push. I think it was just a button. Uh, push launch or something. 
open console. Nope. Punch computer. Get astral bodies from observatory. Nap. Squick is right. Or you keep getting lost in space. Uh, there's an observatory. We never saw one. Yeah, I, I think I would have seen that. Yeah. With my eyes. Push platform. That's what Steel says. Right. There, there you go. Why are you being British? It's lever in the U.S. That's what that's what Bully Stank says. Like the soap. I I'm saving this game because I have navigated to space. Okay. You now have a gadget in your inventory and hell yeah, spacesuit. But yeah, we're just playing it blind. We've never actually played uh, this through, so... I appreciate the help. Uh, oh, the console... Uh, okay, uh, indicated the throttle. Oh. Some buttons. The buttons are marked auto-nav, power, and don't touch. Oh. Wait, did they have an apostrophe? Do they understand apostrophes? I don't know. Push. Don't touch. It has no effect now. Oh. Because there's no power, right, probably. Have to turn it on, right. Remember, buckle your seatbelts. Push power. Try don't touch now. Oh. Uh -huh. Um... Bonk. Okay. Look screen. Emergency. Okay. Pull throttle to execute launch sequence. Okay. You need to actually close the door and buckle your seatbelt. Push. Don't touch. No. Fine. I know all the fun is <laughs> sucked out. Close door. Done. Now pull lever, maybe? Push the fine. Yes, your first experience with Space Quest, and you're excited to see this chess dragon? Awesome, yeah. Yow. Yes, this this is great, because I am the worst person to be playing this. Uh, so I do make some number of apologies, but not enough to stop. Oh, uh, you are now traveling aimlessly through the cosmos. Okay. No, I used AutoNav. Look, console. Uh, da -da -da -da. Okay. It wasn't don't touch. I it said don't touch. I warned you. Uh, yeah, and oh, uh, you're in wait, King's what? Quest now. Bonk. Ken, <laughs> did you hear something? It was probably just the Gators entertaining another Space Quest player. Go back to sleep, Berta. That raises so many additional <laughs> questions. <laughs> Though a strange quirk of fate, or was it, you have stumbled into a place beyond time, space, and dimension. You have entered the Daventry Zone. That's right, the land of King's Quest. This will not help you since you are playing Space Quest. That's good to know. I, and also, Ken and Roberta Williams are uh, the the owners and creators of Sierra and Space Quest, or uh, King's Quest, and all the other Quest games. That's a lot of gators. Um, they seem mad that I pushed the button they told me not to push. Uh, welcome to... Yeah, Bully Snake, that's... Welcome to the Squick Argues with Friend Computer and Gets Punished stream. That is... Is that not how you play Paranoia? That's why <laughs> I play Paranoia. We also... Yeah, you're at four deaths now. I... Only slightly alivant, I am now several crocodiles. Now I'm curious if there's actually an observatory. I wouldn't put it past this game to put something that we just totally missed, and then we get in the escape pod. All right, let's go look at the rest of the ship. Maybe I can get, like, some nachos or um, a yeah. nap time pillow. 
Oh, no, Squirk, watch out for Mecha. Oh, no, she's right there. Ah, ah, ah. What, what that was just the, ring? That was just the sound of the MT-32 just telling you the door was shutting. Terrifying. In space, no one can hear you. You think no, you hear footsteps. No. Oh, you have to scan the key card to use the door every time. One of those. Oh, God. Squirk, no! You slide the key card into the <laughs> slot. <laughs> Just as you get shot in the face. <laughs> Sir, can you come back in a minute? I'm busy. <laughs> the Sarians uh, will kill you. Uh, yeah, apparently. As you uh, lie on the floor, yeah, you wonder why you bother getting up for work this morning. Well, I'm not. I'm just trying to steal things. All right, fine. <laughs> so many deaths. We've lost but five it's... spacemen so far. Look, the rest of the ship is already dead. What's one more a few times over? It's only a little bit of violating causality. Could you imagine that if this was like in an arcade? <laughs> oh, <laughs> you put God. so many quarters in. Okay, I gotta be honest. That, on the one hand, super frustrating. On the other hand, just as an object. Oh no, you don't. No, no. Yeah, that's what I thought. You just did that in case you need to run. Yep. I've cowarded before. I know how to run. You do. Please insert 40 quarters. <laughs> yeah. What was it? Examine room? You are in a central control of the Arcada. The reactor domes pulsate irregularly as if they've been tampered with. This does not look good. Though the window just above the control console, you can see into the vehicle bay below. Oh, somebody's using the vehicle bay outside. Which sounds like code, honestly. I need to go use the vehicle bay. I agree. What, here? What? Look wall. Do I no. need to use more window? No, let's just keep going to the left. Store bodies at console? Yeah. I'm, I'm looking at chat because I feel like chat knows things. They contain secrets, and only some of those secrets will result in death. On the console by the window, there's open bay door and closed bay door. Uh, okay, yes, the doors are open. Take console. Can't obtain. It's right in front of me. Come on. Fine. I'm gonna shuffle my way on. Yeah, we've already uh, searched that body. Yeah, we've uh, done. For but we haven't gone to the weird yeah. room with the curtains, which I suppose is a clue. If there's a place you haven't gone to, it's where you need to be. Yeah, we're, as I said, we're trying to blind play through, so try not to blurt out all the answers if you can. I appreciate but it. But also, like, I'm, yes. I am dumb as hell. Well, Pro yeah, is we'll, very smart. We, we will yell out if we need an answer for sure. <laughs> I'm not, I'm not above that. I'm just saying, like, right now, oh, look. Oh. Wait, I just oh, this room That's looks different. Annoying. I was apparently tripping on the side of it. Just, uh, yet another body lies motionless. Space First quest. quest. <laughs> hey, Diggs. Oh, more of a Hugo oh, yeah, guy. Me. Yeah. Da 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 da. Yeah. Oh God, what is that from? Hugo's House of Horrors. I don't know what that is, but I recognize the song. Also, do we get to play with the claw machine? I don't know. You have to look around this room. I know nothing about this area. We just, first time I've seen it. Well, I mean, I just, I want some space quarters for the giant death arm. Is this the bridge? Uh, I don't think I'm authorized to be there. Examine room. This is the Star Generator Development Laboratory. Due to your incredibly low security clearance, you have never been allowed access to this room. Then who's cleaning it? I mean, not that I would clean it anyway, but still. Well, they, their logic is probably like, why would you need to clean it? Who's bringing food and drinks into the star generator room? These assholes. That's why everyone's dead. Ah. You see a sprawl at your feet, a lifeless body of another crew member. 
I mean, that's that's fair. Um, look, console. Your mind is boggled with uh, in attempting to understand the function of the various buttons, switches, lights, and displays. It appears the board is not operating. Excellent. Now I'm going to do the universal gamer sign for I'm about to try something very smart. Okay, very good. Um, push console. Say what? Mm. It's the dragnet theme. Yeah, exactly. Ah, e. Oh, right. I have water hidden behind my microphone that I almost just smacked over. Yeah, time for a drink. Mmm. My meats are lubricated. For now. But at what cost? What did this water cost you? Examine star generator. There is no star generator here to look at. What the hell is the dang is <laughs> What the hell is wrong with this game? I'm going to walk to the left. Okay. So help me when I get murdered for this crime. No, I, will have deserved I don't think there's anything to the left. Okay, fine. Then we'll look at the console. You know, on I the remember right. there being a door when you first started. There was a door on the left, but you never like went to it. This door is closed. Okay. Now examine console. Same thing. Flail. <laughs> you don't oh, understand don't flail. Uh! How does it not understand flail? What year was uh, the Muppet Show released? Uh, that would be uh, late seventies, early eighties, somewhere in there. I okay, so this would have been a contempt. Oh, um, kaboom! Oh, that seems bad. Gosh, space, Greg. It would appear you have met an untimely demise. With the explosive destruction of the Arcada, you become part of the fresh collection of space debris. I'm beginning to get the feeling they don't like me. <laughs> you got you got a limited time. I think that's what it's trying to tell us. Well, um, no. Give me another quarter. I must play again. Yes. The Muppet Show was that's seventy-four to eighty-one. Though. Really, it it feels so much newer. We just must run. We must run. We don't have time. Uh, not, remember, the ship is exploding. Yeah, but not very well, and I can't run. We need to so go I'm to another gonna... area. I don't know if there's anything there's... in here to do. Peering through the large observation windows, you take in the immense panorama of space and stars. What the hell? I'm looking at the room. Uh... What? Mm. What is the thing in the middle of the room? I, apparently, a thing you don't understand. This might become. This might be important to another person, but not to janitor. That's fair. Maybe this room is meant for you to waste your time in, so you blow up. No jokes on. Uh. Uh. What? Do you don't have the uh, key? You don't have the. You don't have the number pad to get through the door. C. A, B, cabbage. <laughs> In interesting? What was that? Okay. I, what, what did that box come up from? I don't know. I clicked seven, on seven, like, the seven. text parsing area. Uh, area. I'm, I'm shuffling as fast as I feel like. <laughs> Stop screaming astral bodies. We'll get there. Walk left. We'll get there, I promise. Um, the most so recent save file is soft locked at this point. There isn't time to get back out, says Adrian. Are you serious? Hey, I told you I was going to find a way. You soft locked the game already. Well done. <laughs> I heard that that was a common thing with this game, uh, in this whole series, actually. Yeah, that door on the left we never looked in, or the one in, in front of us. Oh, no. Wait, no, I have questions. Because right before that, I heard footsteps. So did they just not leave? Look, the Saurians weren't really labeled as the smartest alien species in the universe. 
Oh, that's fair. They did just show up and start shooting people. Also fair. Jonathan says you might have to restart the whole game. Hey, that means I get another nap. Actually, you could just restore to an earlier save where the ship wasn't in, uh, exploding yet. Well, I true, but did that timer start when we walked out of the closet, or did that start when we uh, saw I think it's the... When we, uh, I think it's when the game starts. Because uh, okay. I heard that there's a lot of time limits in this game. Uh, yeah, let's go choice. back to Space Wallet. I think that's probably it. Really a save. So we can take a look at those doors on the far left. Okay, yeah. So we just have to walk back to the right and then go down the elevator and to the left, yeah. Down the elevator to the left. Syrians are a random encounter, yeah. Now Space Greg is just Dust Greg. Wow, Space Greg's face is terrifying. Sierra that, Games, that is... why are you here? Back um, then, look, back then, this was, like, super exciting because the best, the only way you could restart this game is by turning your computer off. <laughs> and then you turn it back on, and, hey, look, the game works again. <laughs> I, mean, I, I guess? Nope. Wait, where would footsteps even be coming from? From your right, probably. Oh, yeah, okay. That's fair. So if you walk to the left and walk back that way? Yeah, all right. So now Don't worry, we've confused them with our advanced Earth navigation. Can you walk up into the door? I don't know, I can examine the room. I think that was just the closet. Okay. One of the many hallways. So fancy. Yeah, so we never looked at this door. Which I... Really? 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 Fine, examine. Exanube. That's how you spell examine. Examube. <laughs> Examine room. This is one of Arcata's data archive. The uh, many volumes of information are stored on data cartridges. There is a computer console here. Oh, that's that's good. Um, use console. How would you like to do that? Look console, maybe. Fist computer. <laughs> I don't understand fist. <laughs> Looking nervous. <laughs> Console consists of a screen, keyboard, and a cartridge slot. Drop it uh atop it rests a model DX cartridge retrieval unit. Oh god. If the files are inside the computer. Try going to the <sighs> while we go to the door in the left, we'll come back to this room. I'm busy doing the opposite of learning. I feel like I'm receiving less information with each passing moment. We are. <laughs> Wait, now that works. What? I call foul. That's just... Te that's terrible, man. I don't understand. Hey, oh. The door opens and a man you recognize as one of the lab scientists injured. He is, appears to be injured. You got a wallet? After a few uh, steps, he slumps to the floor. And oh, you need to go take a look at this guy. Cool. N you already had your nap. You just <laughs> you lay next to him. You're like, oh. <laughs> yeah, like it's comfy. Look, science. <sighs> Fingers, you betrayed me again. A large laser hole has been burned into his uniform, through which you can see previously unexposed tissue. Struggling painfully, he raises up on one elbow. Oh, wow, he's still alive. Okay. Let's look at him. Uh, take a, uh, he tells you that the Arcata is under attack and that the star generator is in danger. You had better leave if you value your life. Uh, uh, this would have been wonderful information to have. Search this man. Take all of his... He looks over toward the shells full of cartridges and utters the words, Astral Body, and then settles to the floor lifeless my good science dude we are in space that is quite similar to with your dying breath staring at the floor of a mall and just whispering city <laughs> city <laughs> 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 okay well let's 
let's take a look at that monitor. I already had say hello queued up, so that does not compute. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah, let's. Astral let's go. bodies. Uh. Look, computer. Uh, look monitor. Try that. Oh. Hey! Welcome to the Arcada Data Archive Model DX Storage and Retrieval System. Pornography. <laughs> <laughs> Please enter a cartridge title below. Astro body. Title found. Retrieving. Can you? Oh, it it do be zooping. There you go. Hell yeah. You go, funky little robot. That's lovingly animated, but also hurry the hell up. You've put me on a time limit and then made everything slower. Uh, take cart to take cartridge. Oh, did we search the part? scientist? By the way, uh, not yet. Okay. Before we leave this room, make sure we get everything. Oh, he doesn't. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You have to stop him. Try search body. Steal shit. A mind is a terrible <laughs> thing to waste. Oh, fine. Search body. You search the body, damaged body, and you pockets nets. A eh? only some hey. heat fused chunks of varying sizes, which were probably melted by a pulse ray blast. Nothing to waste time on. Aww, free candy. Okay, not to worry. I know what to do. We're going to save? Oh, you're Hell thinking yeah, for your footsteps. You need to run back to the left before you save. Or you no, no, this is fine. Oh, no. <laughs> That's the name of it. I'm strutting to safety. No. Oh, oh yeah. Really? I don't think you can't win. You can't win this thing. <sighs> <laughs> Seven deaths. I, you know, even caught in a temporal loop where death is inevitable and painful. I tried to say to we should probably. <laughs> I was gonna say I, I understand that, but this man cannot be rushed. <laughs> he will strut at all times. Running, running space, is not. A yeah. Thing. Well, Space Greg <laughs> tries. Space Greg is experiencing. Okay, let's let's try that one more time. All right. Can Space Greg get to the oh, door before uh, he's shot no horribly? This time. Oh, oh, and you're no. dead. No. <laughs> <laughs> it's perfect. You've done it. That guy's a jerk. Okay. Edge of Tomorrow, but Tom Cruise is an idiot. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. <laughs> We're just, we are not very Accurate. good at this game. Oh. <laughs> All right. So, Ona, uh, you know, actually, you can't reload there. You have to reload at the oh. space wallet. All right. It it all starts with the space wallet. Yeah. That's where everything happened. We should probably have saved it in that room after we have done that whole thing with the sign. <laughs> wait, we could go into the room from here. Remember that door up there? Oh, wait, is that? Yes, yes, yes you are correct, sir. <laughs> we, we had the wrong pixel. You just got to think of the space station like... Um, like I a thought big it was supposed to like be a, a beaded curtain. Like a donut. Space donut. <laughs> this is some horse shit. Okay. There's no reader. <laughs> you keep look. This is a this is a world where reader is not a thing. Okay. Look cartridge or no? It was look cart that lo that worked. It does not possess the designated item, or is it look monitor? Okay. 
There you go. So I'm guessing this is how you stop from getting lost in space. That is my hope. We'll find out. Da, 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 da. <laughs> yeah, that that is an angry Cylon. Take cart. Done. Excellent. Where's the old man that comes in here and dies horribly? I don't know. Sounds like not my problem. We out. Good call. Run nope. back! No! <laughs> Actually, you should go to the left because because that leads closer yeah. to your destination. Oh, okay. Fair, fair. But now we're going to get ambushed by Science Man. Is he, though? Who Was he also a random encounter? I don't know. It sounds like it might have been. There's a lot of random encounters in this game so what far. What the hell? A game with random encounters <laughs> that requires you to solve obtuse puzzles? Is this a Sierra game? Are we playing? The game is a strong word. I'm certainly having the Sierra experience. This is a simulator. What's it simulating? The average work day? Yeah. I, yeah, I remember going. It was, there was nothing in there. I just wanted ah, to see. Clock speed movement. Good times. They did actually, uh, I believe, on this one. Making my way downtown. <laughs> What's in that elevator there? Oh, right. Problems. You have to take. You have to take that elevator. This leads to a dead end. But I'm strutting. All right, fine. We'll take the elevator. We got to take the elevator so Space Greg can get to space. Ah, oh, yeah. Space Greg do like space with space, space. We gonna go down to Electric Avenue. You're right. There is a way to increase the animation speed to move faster. The problem is, though, that it makes everything faster, including the bad guys, which can lead to hilarious death animations. Meow. Okay, they didn't have anything worth stealing. I oh, do yes. need to push the Dangus machine. Yes. Uh, um, push push open? open? Yeah, I think so. I, I want to get Depp to play Police Quest with me, actually. Push open. I think Depp would love that game, or at least hate it. And have I mean, fun with it. Yeah, I, I want to do I've that. played Virtua Cop. That's similar. You nope. Did. Nicely done. <laughs> ah. No. <laughs> Fuck you. Look at that. <laughs> the old double, double back. Use card. Space Force Quid, who had, uh, two had a Tasmanian devil monster that would spin in and eat you at max speed. It looked fucking hysterical. <laughs> Open the pod bay doors! Oh, yes. Now we must go around the railing and pull a lever, get our space gadget. Push left, push right. Okay, if you guys are just yeah. joining us at the at this moment, we have already done this uh, before. That's why we're doing it so quickly. <laughs> we we had died and got soft locked, so now we are just doing it all over repeatedly. Again. But we are making progress. We did get we off have the ship. We frozen this man in time at the moment of death. This is like this is exactly like that Tom Cruise movie. Uh, push door. Uh, pull lever. Say what? Oh, look panel. See what it is. Oh, push airlock. Okay. You did it. Oh, uh, yes. The jingly alarm letting you know that it is, of course, very safe to go through there with your open face helmet and wearing no gloves. It's true. It is very safe. Extremely safe. I'm safest. really glad that Scum VM exists, though. They did such a great job allowing games like this to work again. Oh, yeah. Like, this This is a love letter here. Uh, push lift. What was it again? I think it was, like, look, <laughs> yeah, look on this platform. Uh, yes, of course. A word we use often. Does that make this a platformer? Dear God, do you really want that? Look, I'm just busy strutting across the entirety of this airlock slash tennis court. Okay. 
can't perform that action from here. You have to get in front of the door. <laughs> the, the hitbox. Okay. Good enough. I should not be playing Hit Detection Simulator. It's actually also, to be fair, Mecha does not like how you have she'll like play King's Quest 1 and say click on something and then Graham will like navigate not anywhere around any dangers. Just, yeah. she. It, 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 this game requires you to do everything for it. Done. You wore your seatbelt. Nice. Save game. And that is, you can actually type that. Oh. That's cool as hell. I didn't know you could do okay, that. Okay, that... Save game is just yes. This game just got a that's, whole lot cooler. That's a really nice quality of life thing. I'm going to drink more of this water. Hell yeah, ducks. I've only died several times to the dumbest things imaginable, and I've almost got a rental car. Indeed. Let's save the game. Oh, we did already. Uh let's Yeah. Flip console. Look monitor. Uh, Pathfinding is not an option. Yeah. Pull lever. There we go. The skate pod moves slowly out of the vehicle bay and into space. Hell yeah. Okay, I'm now traveling through Cotton Candy Spaceland. Indeed. Have fun out there, uh, to Square. Have a good night, Square. So, a uh, quick aside. Ross, it is an unfortunate reality that, um, as a teenager, I did not look up the name before adopting it. <laughs> I was very fortunate that the name Crowwind I made up was not used by anyone at the time. Yeah, no, I I took like uh this is the sound of the audio glitch from one of the Mac Warrior games. I am very clever. Followed by Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. All right, let's click past this thing. Press the auto nav button again. Oh, it's already done that. Okay. You're sitting in the pilot seat of the escape pod facing toward the window. There's a dark console uh, before you and a seatbelt straps your side. Uh, confused as to what you should do, you wish you would have paid more attention during crew orientation. Use cart. Would allow that. Um, fly good. I don't understand good. I guess we just wait. A wind is a terrible thing to waste. Uh, the monitor flashes. You study it to see what is the information being displayed. Oh, new information. Look at screen. Oh, planet profile. Here we oh, go. Oh, it's planet square. Oh, no, it's... Okay, that, planet that's Corona. genuinely pretty cool. Dimensions. Okay. 3,000 kilometers diameter. Breathable atmosphere. No unknown... 40 Celsius... No, thank you. This uh, no, <laughs> you're locked onto no, the small planet of Corona, no, and the pod has no. begun its approach. Nothing to do, no, but hang on. No, turn on the air <laughs> conditioner. We're leaving. I am not hanging out at forty Celsius. So that is a jazzy tune. Well, this planet has many attractions, so, uh, such as poor landing. After a skull-jarring landing, you peer through the shattered viewing point, uh, port onto the desert landscape. A feeling of utter desolation settles in. You're in a fine mess now, Space Greg. Don't worry. I know exactly what to do. Let's I've trained for this situation. Save your game. Um... Oh, this is in case this clicking down there. I'm guessing is so you can enter text manually with your mouse if you don't have a keyboard or if you're using like a, a tablet. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. okay. Yeah, that makes sense. You can play it on your old rotary telephone. 
Uh, look ship. Let's look. Let's examine the crap. Let's examine our our ship. Let's like look. Why isn't it letting me nap again? You don't need another nap. This planet sucks. Leaves. I don't understand sucks. <laughs> Type in a look ship. I want to see what the damage okay. is. Okay. Oh, excuse me. You are inside the escape pod. It appears that more fragile devices were damaged severely by the impact of the landing. Well, if they were that fragile, they couldn't be that important. Um. So yes, you're gonna have to uh, save the game. I, I just did. Oh well, then unbuckle your seatbelt and get out. Oh, a survival kit. You may need to. Cool. Oh wait, where's that? Done. Oh, you I found a survival kit. Nice. Nice. Good find. I didn't even see <laughs> yes. that. Excellent, Ducks. I cast Horse Explosion. All right, now you definitely want to save your game now that you've found a survival kit. Hell yeah. Do you think it'll let me survive? Uh, no. <laughs> I don't think it will. All right, I guess just unbuckle your seatbelt and get out. No, we're taking the off. The seems to be jammed. It won't budge. But I appreciate that they added the hand movement. <laughs> push power. <laughs> that slow push, like uh... <laughs> seatbelt. Open door. The door is permanently opened by the impact of the landing. So I guess you just that's access. not a good door. No. <laughs> well, you did crash land as everyone does. Leave. Shit. Oh, stop moving. Wow, this planet sucks. Wow. You seem to be located in an incredibly remote area. There's a thrashed escape pod here. Examine the survival kit. This is a your survival kit. It contains xenon army knife and a dehydrated water. <laughs> a can of dehydrated <laughs> De water. Yeah, just add water. It's a perfect survival item. Ah. Uh. Anyway, I think that's a good point to stop. We can pick up again next week. How's that sound? That sounds delightful. This has been wonderful. Thank you so much for having me. Through, yeah. uh Oh, wait. No, there's an important step here. Go there's for one it. One thing we forgot to do. Go for it. Indeed. Well, yes. Save. We are now on Excellent. a desert planet. Oh, well. We'll pick it up next we can see where we take off next time nap time you already had your nap anyway no, let me space nap <laughs> <laughs> anyway thanks a lot everybody for hanging out with us here on the courtesy flush uh we'll be back again uh on friday with more uh either mre probably not because i think goat's still gonna be out and um sherlock holmes so until oh, then ooh. You guys, take care. Have a good evening, and thanks a lot for... And Squick, by the way, thanks for stopping by and hanging out with me here on the Courtesy Flush. I know we've been talking about it for, like, years, but now you're here. Well, it's my very good pleasure to be here. Thank you so much for having me, and have a wonderful evening, or happy time zone, audience. I look forward to seeing you again. Thank you, everybody. Have a good night, and we'll see you next time here on the Courtesy Flush. Take care. <laughs>